how to fix ChatGPT file stream access denied. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix an issue where you're getting an error in the ChatGPT app on your iPhone, Android phone, or Samsung phone that says file stream access denied. And if this video helps you, please consider giving it a like and also subscribe to my channel because that really helps me out. So most likely if you're getting the file stream access denied error within ChatGPT, it's not anything that you're doing in particular where you were like banned or anything like that. It's an issue with ChatGPT. So the first thing I would recommend doing is simply closing the ChatGPT app. And you could do that on an Android phone by selecting the little menu button at the bottom and then just swiping away the app and that closes it. Then you can open it up and see if you're still getting the issue. On an iPhone, you would just swipe up from the bottom and then, until you see the app get small and then swipe it away. Now, if you're still getting that issue, what I recommend doing is making sure you have the latest version of ChatGPT on your phone because this could definitely cause this error. And to do that, open up your respective app store, either the Google Play Store on an Android phone or the app store on an iPhone, and then just search ChatGPT. Once ChatGPT comes up, select it. And if it says update, go ahead and select update. And this will download the latest version of ChatGPT to your phone and install it and hopefully get rid of the file stream access denied error. Now, if you have an update available and you install it and you're still getting that error, the next thing I would recommend doing is simply uninstalling the ChatGPT app. And you can do that by long pressing it and selecting uninstall. On an iPhone, you would simply select delete, then go back to the app store and reinstall it. Now, lastly, if you're still getting this error, what I recommend doing is opening up a browser and navigating to status.openai.com and just simply find under system status ChatGPT. If it doesn't have a check next to it, that means they're having some sort of system-wide error where they are not serving ChatGPT to you simply because their servers are down and it has nothing to do with you. So you can keep going back to this website, refreshing it. And once you see we're fully operational or it has a green check next to it, that means that it should be good to go and you can start using ChatGPT. All right, so hopefully that fixed the file stream access denied error on ChatGPT. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel.